good morning good afternoon and good evening nowadays samsung mobile phone users are talking about the latest firmware of one ui 7 because one ui 7 is coming with latest features with beautiful icons and colors so those who have galaxy note 10 series like old mobile phone also want to get the ported rom of one ui 7 and even those who are using oldest Galaxy mobile phone, they also want to have or to get One UI 7. Well, I am getting a lot of messages that how to get One UI 7 on this mobile phone, on this mobile phone, etc, etc. Well, the porting is not an easy job and usually bugs comes if porting the latest firmware for the oldest mobile phone. Well, I tried a lot on my different Samsung mobile phone flashing the GSI One UI 7 ROM. Yes, it got flash but didn't boot it. Only the Galaxy A73 was the one which was booted with the One UI 7 GSI ROM. And I will bring the flashing video very soon. So I was reading on different forums that the latest mobile phone like starting from the Galaxy S22, S23, S24 etc etc like A26, A56, A55 they are getting booted with the GSI One UI 7 portrait ROM. So I decided to buy Galaxy S22 because this phone is little like cheap in price comparing it with the ultra series well for me galaxy s22 is not that cheap because the price that i got while i was uh, buying the mobile phone i was thinking i can buy two box pack mid-range mobile phones anyway i sold my two mobile phone and uh, adding some more amount to buy the galaxy s22 of exynos chipset well the phone was having an oldest stock firmware android 12 so i decided to update the mobile phone manually by flashing the stock firmware with the help of odin yes i did that and then i unlocked the bootloader and then i tried to flash the gsi one ui 7 rom ported from the galaxy a56 it was flash like it caught flash but did not boot it i didn't give up then i tried to flash the gsi one ui 7 rom ported from the galaxy a26 exynos yes it got flash also and it booted finally on the galaxy s22 this gsi one ui 7 ported from the galaxy a26 is surprisingly almost stable and yes, I can use this One UI 7 Beta as my daily driver. Okay, let me show what are the things working with the Galaxy S22 having the One UI 7 ported ROM. So this is One UI 7 Android 15 ported from Galaxy A26. Finally booted on Galaxy S22 having an Exynos chipset. So I will start from the unlocking screen. The face unlocking is provided and yes, it is working very fine and very fast. But uh, mostly GSI ported ROM have some issues with the fingerprint scanner. So this ROM is not having fingerprint scanner. I did a call and yes, the incoming and outgoing calls Welcome working fine. Welcome the other party can hear my voice and i can hear the other party voice and surprisingly this rom is also providing call recording feature which is working you like uh, if you want to make a call and uh, during call if you want to record the call you can just tap the record button the call will start recording and if you turn on the auto call recording so the calls are like incoming and outgoing both will be recorded automatically so i turn off my wi-fi to check the mobile data the mobile data working fine and the volte is also available which is working with my second sim card both sim card inserted in my mobile phone both signals are coming in a good health and network or the mobile data working with this port i was surprised looking the magis application app after flashing the rom which was not prominent like rom is half pre-rooted 
but after tapping the magis application and when the magis application totally get installed so the rom will get 100 percent rooted and then i took advantage to install the play integrity fix module and making my google play store or making the device certified so now the device is certified and I'm not getting any issues with the Play Store installation of the applications which requires device to be certified. Yes, most probably you heard that the GSI have sound issues. Well, this ported GSI ROM is not having any issues with the sound. If you want to make a call, you can just uh, talk with the other party. The sound, yes, it is working. The applications downloaded from the google play store working fine with no issues like uh, i downloaded many applications and i am using it currently right now like netflix youtube etc etc no issues with this port uh, downloading straight away from the google play store i checked the auto brightness the auto brightness working fine no issues found using it mostly gsi ported rom not coming with the pre-installed applications like this rom also coming few samsung applications pre-installed like galaxy store was not provided with the rom so i searched on the internet and i downloaded the galaxy store apk and then i installed it manually on the mobile phone now the galaxy store is working i got the galaxy store and i have downloaded few apps from the galaxy store also like i got two store the google play store and the galaxy store both are working fine the bluetooth device is connected successfully Yes, the Bluetooth connectivity and the audio via Bluetooth or wireless working very fine. Mostly GSI ROM does not come with the pre-installed camera applications. So we have to install the third party application from the Play Store to take pictures and to record videos. I installed the open camera application from the Google Play Store and I am using it which is working fine like taking pictures and recording videos this is what i call stable rom although this is the gsi port but still things are working fine with this port and these are the most important things or options that we use usually on every day those who have galaxy s22 series and if they know how to flash the gsi rom and if you are a flashaholic you like to check or you like to have different rom then must go for this one so definitely and soon i will bring another video how to flash this rom on the galaxy s22 stick with my channel by subscribing it if you are getting help from my videos do not forget to like the video if you have any questions you can ask me in comment sections thank you so much for watching this video take a good care of yourself I will see you in my next video. Until then, goodbye.